Everybody, it just turned 6.40 in the morning on Saturday, February 18th, 2023, and I'm getting ready to do the bike. Good morning. So my stack today was 75 minutes. This says I did 71, which I'll take, but two out of, or two out of the three rings are done and dusted. And we have 6,397 steps with 2.81 miles. So you really don't have to sit with me every time I switch positions. Only a couple more days. You're not going to be able to sit with me all the time just yet because my, my scar is going to be like right here. It's like on my stomach area. I think honestly last time we put them on the left side. I don't know. Little buddy, little dude. But you know what's funny? He, like, only sits with me during this time and then, like, when I go to bed at night. But, like, he doesn't sleep in my bed. He'll sleep in my mom's room. I don't know. He only likes me certain times of the day. Hey, everybody. I have some surgery stuff that I need, that I got, that I need to show you or surgery prep stuff, or surgery prep slash recover, but whatever. Anyway, but it is 1.26 right now, and I just finished lunch, and my mom um, was running errands. She came home to help me use the restroom and get lunch, and then she's going out to do two more things, and then we're going to order some coffee, and then have a... Chill the rest of the afternoon. If you hear crunching in the background, that's because my girl Hope is eating a chew bone from the local, like, ha not dog health foods. I, I don't know what they, um, health food store that, um, we go to often for their dog food and stuff. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you some stuff that I got for surgery and... Well, see, I had this whole big thing in my head where I was like, oh, you know, I'm going to have to stay over, so I'm going to have to plan videos, blah, 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 when in reality, I think I'm going to be pretty good. They're letting me go home the same day. Which is kind of which is kind of crazy for modern medicine, isn't it? <clears throat> you can do something with the spine. Well, I mean, I'm not having surgery on my spine, but the the surgeon who's doing the surgery deals with the spine because the catheter goes into my you know, you know the whole nine yards. The catheter goes into my spine and whatever, but. I just think it's crazy 
that I can do all that and go home the same day, which is amazing. Um, but I got some new pajamas and normally I go to um, Amazon, but they didn't really have what I was looking for or what I was envisioning for myself. Um, so my mom found these at Kohl's. These are just um, pajama pants with a string on the front and they're blue polka dots. They're like really soft. I think, I think they're a cotton, cotton blend. And then, oh, hold on. Let me just throw this on top of my six sweaters that I have right here. Is so anybody else wear a sweatshirt like in the morning and then they get warm and then they take it off, put it back on again? Because that's me. Um, and then I got, this is a pajama set. I don't really have too many of these because normally I just usually wear like whatever kind of pants and stuff. But I, I don't know. I want it to kind of look nice. Um leaving the hospital at least, maybe. And then I had this fixation that like nothing could go over my head, which they haven't told me that that's true, but I don't know, sometimes you get like a point in your head and you're like, no, it needs to be this way, or at least I do. Um, so I got this nice button shirt, and I don't know, I thought this would just be better than you know sweatpants or whatever i don't know i mean not that the doctors care but you know i don't know i just thought it would be cute to have like a matching set so i like this one and i think i'm gonna wear this one home because it's dark and you know if any sort of bodily functions go through um, it's fine. Because you best believe that I am, or <laughs> maybe not me, I'm stopping at uh, coffee on the way home, but you best believe I'm going to make somebody bring it to me. Um, and then I got the same set, so... These better be comfy, otherwise I have two pairs, but whatever. I got the same set, but in um, cheetah print. So again, the pants, pants with the tag, boots with the fur, with the fur pants and then I don't know if I mentioned it but you probably you probably saw it is that the shirt um is The shirt's short sleeves, not long sleeves. And this um, brand is Croft and Barrow from Kohl's. I can't, I actually, I think I have some of their stuff. I don't even know. I have like so much stuff in my closet, like some stuff from high school still and like I only wear like the same five things, so maybe this will get me out of my rut of wearing the same stuff that I've had for years. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited to wear those. Um, that's why what, what I usually do. The two things that I usually do before surgery is I cut my hair and I get a new pair of pajamas. So, yeah. Also, Lent begins um, next week, February 22nd, and ends on the 6th, I believe, of April. 40 days. 
See, I always say I don't know what I'm going to give up. And I always say, like, oh, I'm going to give up social media. But, like, that never works. But, honestly, this year, I don't think I'm going to give up anything. Because, like, honestly, it's been a really tough year. And, um, I don't know. Maybe I'll, like... I mean, I I have gotten into the habit of, like, reading my Bible and stuff every day, which is good. But maybe I'll, like, try to get into the habit of not only, like, biking and working out every day, but also, like, meditating. I think that would be good. And for those of you who think, like, prayer and meditation are the same thing, it's not. Prayer is, like, you know, you're talking directly to your your higher power or God or whatever you believe in. I believe in God, you know, um, and meditation from, I should say this for me, for me, my personal opinion, that is what prayer is. And then meditation for me is just working on my breath and being like present in the moment. Um, Maybe that's because I went to counseling on and off for many years in my younger years. And they're always like, oh, you should meditate. You should, you know, deep breathe, whatever. Ooh, if I told you how many times somebody said, oh, you can fix your anxiety if you just deep breathe. Man, I would be a millionaire. I would, like, have my little ranch in the country. I... I have a couple of horses, you know. Oh man, I'd be rich. All, all of that to say, if you are observant of Lent, um, what are you going to be working on this year? And or maybe not taking out, but maybe adding in to your life over the next 40 days and then hopefully to continue. Um let me know in the comments below. And as always, I, anytime I share um, religion or stuff like that, I am not um, pushing it down anybody's throat. In fact, I welcome anybody's beliefs. I find it really interesting to learn about different people and their beliefs. That's why I love my international audience, my audience from Canada, my audience from the UK, and that's why I'm, I'm constantly asking questions like, well, what do you guys do for this? What do you guys do for that? You know, blah, blah, blah. I, you know what? As long as, as long as you're kind to me and as long as you're respectful to me, which you guys are amazing, I'm going to show that same kindness and respect to you. But as always, I'm not here to push anything. I'm just here to share my experience and my daily life of ups and downs and hardships and wins and celebrations and more hardships and, you know, oh, I got coffee today and, you know, just the simple, the simple things in life. Hey, everybody. So it's 2.45 and I got a coffee. Um... But I'm going to end the video here because I'm going to do some shredding for my aunt before I'm down for the count with surgery and stuff. But it was actually my fault because she gave me this like two weeks ago and I haven't started. So I'm going to go, but I'll see you guys later.